Turkish nationalism is a political ideology that promotes and glorifies the Turkish people, as either a national, ethnic, or linguistic group. History After the fall of the Ottoman Empire, Mustafa Kemal came to power. Atatürk introduced Hilaire de Barentin's Sun language theory into Turkish political and educational circles in 1935, at the high point of attempts to «cleanse» the Turkish language of foreign influence. Turkish researchers at the time also came up with the idea that early Sumerians were proto-Turks. Variants <inaudible> 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 Ideologies associated with Turkish nationalism include Pan-Turkism or Turanism, a form or ethnic or racial essentialism or national mysticism, Neo-Ottomanism, with imperial ambitions derived from the Ottoman era, Anatolianism, which considers the Turkish nation as a separate entity which developed after the Seljuk conquest of Anatolia in the 11th century, and secular, civic nationalist Kemalism. Kemalism Implemented by Mustafa Kemal Atatürk, the founding ideology of the Republic of Turkey features nationalism as one of its six fundamental pillars. The Kemalist revolution aimed to create a nation-state from the remnants of the multi-religious and multi-ethnic Ottoman Empire. Kemalist nationalism originates from the social contract theories, especially from the principles advocated by Jean-Jacques Rousseau and his social contract. The Kemalist perception of social contract was effected by the dissolution of the Ottoman Empire which was perceived as a product of failure of the Ottoman millet system and the ineffective Ottomanism. Kemalist nationalism, after experiencing the Ottoman Empire's breakdown into pieces, defined the social contract as its highest ideal. Kemalist ideology defines the Turkish nation Turkish, Turk Alusu, as a nation of Turkish people who always love and seek to exalt their family, country and nation, who know their duties and responsibilities towards the democratic, secular and social state governed by the rule of law, founded on human rights, and on the tenets laid down in the preamble to the constitution of the Republic of Turkey. The Turkish nation is defined as such. The folk which constitutes the Republic of Turkey is called the Turkish nation. Kemalist criteria for national identity or simply being Turkish, Turkish Turk refers to a shared language, and or shared values defined as a common history, and the will to share a future. Kemalist ideology defines the Turkish people as those who protect and promote the moral, spiritual, cultural and humanistic values of the Turkish nation. Pan-Turkism Turanist nationalism began with the Turanian society founded in 1839, followed in 1908 with the Turkish society, which later expanded into the Turkish hearth and eventually expanded to include ideologies such as Pan-Turanism and Pan-Turkism. The Young Turk Revolution which overthrew Sultan Abdul Hamid II, allowed Turkish nationalism into power, eventually leading to the three Pashas' control of the late Ottoman government, but Mustafa Kemal Atatürk explicitly rejected the ideology of Turanism just as he rejected Pan-Islamism. During the Turkish War of Independence, on December 1, 1921 Kemal stated, We never established Pan-Islamism. Perhaps we said. We are establishing it and we shall complete it. Our enemies said, Let us kill them before they complete it. We never established Pan Turanism. Perhaps we said, We are establishing it and we shall complete it. Our enemies said, Let us kill them before they complete it. That is the whole problem, instead of bringing pressure and resentment upon ourselves from our enemies. Let us know our places. Topic. Anatolianism Anatolianism Turkish, Anadolu Kulik takes as its starting point that the main source of Turkish culture should be Anatolia Anadolu, and the main base of this thought is that the Turkish people had built a quite new civilization in Anatolia after 1071 when they won at the Battle of Manzikert. 
In the early Republican era, some intellectuals proposed that the origins of the Turkish nationalism should be sought in Anatolia, not in Turin. Hilmi Zia Ulkin, one of the founders of Anatolianism, was objecting to Neo Ottomanism and Pan Islamism as well as to Turanism. Between 1918 and 1919 he published the periodical Anadolu with Risat Kai. In 1919 Ulkin wrote a book titled Anadolunan Bugunki Vasvaleri present duties of Anatolia, but it was not published. In 1923, Ulkin and his friends published the periodical Anadolu. They worked to form an alternative thought to Ottomanism, Islamism and Tehranism, and they opposed the specificity of Turkish history traced origins outside of Anatolia. Their conclusion was Memleket Silik, Memleket meaning homeland. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Turkish Islamic synthesis. The tension between Pan-Turkic and Pan-Islamic Turkish nationalism persisted in modern Turkey. Following the 1980 Turkish coup d'état, the compromise solution of a Turkish Islamic synthesis. Turk Islam Sentezi was declared the official state ideology. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Turkish Cypriot nationalism. Emphasizes the support for the independence of the Turkish Republic of Northern Cyprus (TRNC) and desires that the TRNC stay independent from Turkey while opposing the idea of a united Cyprus with the Greek-dominated Republic of Cyprus. The «insulting Turkishness» laws Article 301 of the Turkish Penal Code, which is perceived as being contrary to notion of freedom of speech, states, "...the person who publicly denigrates the Turkish nation, the Republic of Turkey, the Grand National Assembly of Turkey, the government of the Republic of Turkey and the judicial organs of the state, shall be punished with imprisonment of six months to two years." but also it can be only with permission of the Minister of Justice." However, it also states that, "...expressions of thought intended to criticize shall not constitute a crime." There have been recent indications that Turkey may repeal or modify Article 301, after the embarrassment suffered by some high-profile cases. Nationalists within the judicial system, intent on derailing Turkey's full admission into the European Union, have used Article 301 to initiate trials against people like Nobel Prize-winning Turkish novelist Orhan Pamuk, the Turkish novelist Elif Seyfak, and the late Harant Dink for supporting the existence of the Armenian Genocide. In May 2007, a law was put into effect allowing Turkey to block websites that are deemed insulting to Ataturk. See also Pan-Turkism Kemalism Ottomanism Neo-Ottomanism Turanism Turkification Sun language theory Sixteen great Turkic empires Nationalist movement party Notes <laughs>